cut to Interior Sting's massive kitchen. Special Constable Eddie Howe is speaking to Mr Sting. <laughs> this is a f- f- lovely house you have here, Mr Sting. <laughs> you must be very fucking chuffed with it. I am, but what about this fridge? I've never seen one as fucking huge as this before. Is it electric or does it run off some sort of fucking biofuel rocket engine? <laughs> How's your annual? Trudy had it put in when I was touring Peru. Have you tried kicking the fucker? Yeah, of course, I'm very well versed in basic fridge maintenance, mate. Yeah, I'm sure you fucking are, Squire. Have you turned it on and off at the socket? I can't find a socket. I've looked everywhere, including the cutlery drawer, before you get all arsy. If you don't mind me asking, what's the big fucking emergency? Couldn't you just get an electrician to sort it out? No, I could not. I need to show my loot for loot again. The largest gathering of loot players the world has ever seen. I've got 30 minutes till I need to get on me gyrocopter. It's a very strong name, that loot again. But I would have gone for something like Tootie Looty or Looty You, sir. It's loot again, fuck's sake. Everyone is a bastard critic these days. So can you do out or not? Well, I reckon it's just a fucking hunch that the sockets might be behind the actual fucking fridge. So why don't you take one side and let's try and pull the fucking thing out? <laughs> Sting and Eddie pull out the fridge. Eddie turns it off and on, and the buzzing disappears. There you go, sir. That seems to have fixed the fucker. <laughs> yeah, no thanks to you, though. I could have done that myself. So, you have to loot again now, are you? Yes, here, let me play your little song before you nick off. My kitchen fridge, my kitchen fridge was buzzing like a fly. Then Mr. Sting, yes, Mr. Sting, discovered the reason why. He saved the day. Well, I must say, that sounded fucking excellent. I wish you all the best with your loot again. See you, Sting, a good footing look. <laughs> Geordie Heats.